Hello everyone, and welcome back for our next episode in our Dead Space 3 playthrough. What an exciting and fantastic start this game has had, just like the previous two games, top-notch quality. We met Jacob, the new villain, and already I love him. As a bad guy, he's fantastic. It looks like Unitology has really stepped up its game with like a full military force now, and they are wrecking havoc. Isaac apparently is still battling with some kind of remnants of the marker information in his head, to the point where it actually like drove Ellie away because he won't move on with his own life. That was until he found out that Ellie is once again in trouble, possibly, on this station that we just shocked to, and I'm excited to see what all we're gonna find out on this station. If this is your first time finding the channel, welcome, hope you have an awesome time. If you do have a great time, I sure hope you even consider hitting that subscribe button for me. Without any further delay, let's see if we can get in here and find out Ellie is still alive. All right, everybody, we back. We are ready for action. Now, uh, the, we just was told that this. It's a dead end. Oh. Looks like someone shut a bulkhead for quarantine. Oh, can we cut through it? No, it's too thick, but it might cycle open if I can power it up. That worked out pretty good. I forgot, I just reloaded from my last save and apparently the save was right before that. Thoughts of you came drifting back we honor your sacrifice. You will be remembered. No entry. Don't let their memory fade away. So this must be for the person or people that like sacrifice themselves to weld this shut on the other side. Cursed is the man who dies, but the evil done by him survives. Hmm. All right, so that's where we left off. We are working our way into there. Oh, can we do anything with this yet? No, maybe we need to power it on. Let's see what this does. Oop, not quite. There we go. Craft a weapon. Did it. And there's a bench on the same circuit. Bench? With all the parts lying around here, I bet I can make a better weapon than this one. Yeah, yeah, smart thinking. Hey, I actually said something nice. You know, one thing when I was editing the first video, I was like, man, the guys that like rescued me were very rude to Isaac. Like all the way through that whole escape, they were just like, hurry up, do it faster. Get here quick, hurry up, hurry up. I was like, my goodness. It's not like he's not trying to. Okay, so we can finally interact with the bench. Tesla core, E to continue. Heavy standard frame, planet cracker, plasma cutter unlocked. It has been deposited into your safe. Oh, I think I did see something about because I had played Dead Space 2, there was something that was going to be deposited into my safe. Okay. Welcome to the bench. Use the weapon crafting menu to build new weapons or modify your current arsenal. Weapon parts can be accessed here. Now, I had somebody tell me that you can do like... You can like customize and make weapons the way you want them. Like put your own different versions of alt fire and stuff on these, which sounds extremely intriguing. Use the blueprints menu to build weapons from recipes you have found or have received from a co-op partner. Well, that's not gonna happen. Use the weapon upgrades menu to add upgrade circuits to your weapons. Upgrade reload speed, damage, clip size, firing rate, okay. Use the craft items menu to craft ammo, health packs, stasis packs, and more. Use the safe to manage your inventory. Stored weapons can be found here. Share, sell, and move items between your inventory and save. Okay, I was beginning to wonder if I was actually going to have any kind of a, a storage ability in this one. Oh, boy. Upper tool, lower tool. Most weapons support lower tool. Oh, so lower tool, is that supposed to be like the alt fire? To select different part cat. Oh boy. Oh, look at that, it even highlights a section of the gun. That's pretty cool. Uh, okay. Okay, what we got here? Basic line gun. Damage. 
Does it compare it to what I already have on? Wow, so these are like blueprints I can I can possibly find. Is that what these here are? Shotgun. Oh, there's the force gun. Okay. Um back is F. Alright. Here we go. Craft new weapon. Craft a new weapon from the parts. Left weapon slot. Right weapon slot. So I did have somebody clarify. I can actually only hold two weapons. That third slot I found is going to be for uh, a scavenger bot or something to that effect, which I don't have anything to do with that yet, but I'm sure that'll come into play. Mm. Okay, let's select this. Attachment one. That is wild looking. Okay, I'm kind of curious. Uh, frame, we found something underneath the frame, didn't we? Let's suck that. Craft new frame. All weapons start with a frame. Most frames support an upper and lower. Removing this mantle. Now, a standard heavy frame for two-handed weapons. So I guess I can't use it with this one. That's a one-handed weapon. Okay. Uh, what was the other thing I found? I see... Tesla... An inner an engine for high current electric weld. A cutting tool that fires ionized plasma fuel. Okay, so this would completely change. Maybe. So Man, I want to I don't want to mess this gun up. You know what? Let's let's experiment with the uh done. If if I'm going to mess up a gun, I'd rather be this one. I don't want to mess up my favorite weapon. Okay, I need to use the Okay, so this would actually increase clip size and the damage. It will lower the speed. Now, does it cost anything to do this? Attach. Okay, so it has like an electric type of ammo now. Is that basically what that is? Uh, nothing there. Nothing there. Now, lower tool. A military weapon used by at SCAF forces. It doesn't look like it cost me anything to put it on there. Okay. We got that on there now. We'll see what that does. Uh, that's not going to do me any good here because it's also a one-handed weapon. Yo! Wow, you can really do a lot here, can't you? Okay, well we... You unlock strap. Okay. Oh, look at that. You can actually see a, an attachment on the bottom of that now. Okay, let's go back. Uh, nothing there. Weapon upgrades. How does this work? Oh, this is the circuits. So I guess either circuits are something that I will find out there or it's something that I will have to craft. And it looks like, if I had to guess, those are additional circuit slots I can probably purchase or craft so that I can put even more upgrades on said weapon. Okay. Cost. Okay, so to make a, a med pack, that uses the somatic gel. Wow. Oh, someone mentioned that there the nodes 
are kind of changed that instead of getting into those rooms that you would usually use a node for, you actually need one of these little torque bars. Looks like I need scrap metal and tungsten for that. Unlimited stack size though, that's nice. Okay, no, 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 oh, wrong button. No, I'm trying to back out. There we go. Am I still able to sell items? Ooh, yeah. Oh, it's gonna give me... Oh, I see what they've done here. Now selling med packs doesn't necessarily just give me more money to be spent on anything. It's gonna give me more of that gel that can be used either for more med packs or maybe if I come across other things that need that as a recipe. Okay, I see how that works. Okay, well, I'm not gonna sell those just yet. I'm just gonna move them into storage. We'll go with that. We'll move a whole stack of those over. We'll go ahead and move a couple clips of that. Oh, actually, we'll move all those over. Now, does my inventory only hold 25 slots? I hope that scrolls down and gives me more space. <laughs> That's usually like my uh, backup bank. Okay. Okay, well that was kind of cool. Objective complete. Okay, so... Whoa, okay. So if I pull the top tr if the top trigger and bottom trigger is what I'm seeing there. Okay, okay. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanna use this. I don't wanna use all my ammo on that other gun. Oh. That goes up. Well, let's finish exploring before we go through the door there. Oh, I do have me back up in the corner. I noticed in that first episode, <laughs> out of habit uh, I stuck me over there on the side where I normally am as I was editing I was like why does this look a little weird and that's when I remembered uh, the the other the corners where I usually was for dead space so I uh, asked a few people and they said yep it definitely looked better in the corner so I have got me back up here in the corner hey it looks like there's a ladder on the other side too so hopefully you guys didn't find that too distracting in that first episode I know that this is one game where the positioning makes a difference because the health bar is in a very unique position. And uh, most of the time it looked like I wasn't covering, you know, all of it. But, you know, you guys want to be able to see when it's getting low or not. Definitely adds to the tension of those fighting moments. Okay, well, nothing on this side. That's a bit of a bummer. Check out that view, though. That is a blue planet. I'm assuming that's the ice planet that we were seeing at the very beginning. We're probably gonna end up down there at some point, if I had to guess. Ellie may already be down there, who knows? Okay, well that's everything here. If, uh, I'm curious. Oh, I can't take that one out. Oh, I was going to take that out, and I was going to stick that battery over there just to see if it did anything. Oh, it's locked down, too. Okay. Let's check, make sure there's no more loot. In oh, this is remain human remains? Oh, no. <laughs> if there's an arc in the area, or a, a marker in the area, we're going to be in trouble. Okay, do I, is this one of those, or can I just... Doors haven't been open in a while, I take it. My goodness, that was, that was loud and creaky. No, 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 you don't have to close. You can stay open. I'm fine with that. Okay. Okay, this is one I definitely do it like this.
Well, the place is definitely creaky and terrifying. They still got that. Oh! What's that? <laughs> it's terrifying. I felt like I was suddenly being attacked by a velociraptor. What are you? What are these? Are they alive? Uh... Uh... Yeah, it's hanging like... Oh, boy. Oh, crap. Uh... Oh, oh no! Oh. I can't see! Uh... There we go. Oh, you could tell I was rusty. Hey guys, oh. we're in trouble. What is it? What's going on? I just got jumped by what's left of the crew. What? No one could have survived out here that long. They didn't survive. They got turned into those things. What? Okay, what do we do? You keep your weapon ready and you stay the hell away from the ventilation ducts. If they get close, shoot for the limbs. You got that? I said you got that! Yeah, yeah, okay, okay. <laughs> is that good? Not good at all. Oh, scared the crap out of me. I wonder what that is. <laughs> Scaff. Oh, okay. Okay, you're dead too. I wonder if, uh, if like throwing boxes into the enemies hurts them in any fashion. <laughs> Man, I did so bad there. It was embarrassing. It's only been like two weeks. It's been like two weeks since I played Dead Space. Come on. Oh my gosh, this room's huge. This is like a theater room. Orientation, maybe? I do like how, like, you can see the lights coming off of my uh, helmet and stuff now. That's something you couldn't see before. Shoot limbs to... Wait, yeah, I know that now. Could have said that earlier. Oh, boy. So you can't shoot them while they're still up there, it sounds like. Oh, no, you can. Okay. Slow down. Boom. Boom. Oh. Okay. I'm not going to hit that guy anymore from here. Oh, man, he got here fast. Are you dead? <laughs> that guy all of a sudden started crawling really fast. Just because I turned my back? Chump. That's still super fun when you can use the... Uh, the spikes from one to just take out the other. Wow, they are really hooking me up with a lot of uh, med packs. I'm okay with that. Stockpile them. It's so quiet. Some of these doors are like really uh, noisy though. Yeah, it must have been. Oh! <laughs> Lies. Okay, we won't fight your wars. Oh, I did get some disappointing news today. Uh, somebody told me that the uh, Overseers is actually something that's not even covered in this game. It's kind of like just a, a big cliffhanger from the <laughs> number two that never really led into anything. I was like, oh man. So, I guess we can put that mystery to rest of if that's going to be covered in this game or not. Oh. Okay, discovered. 
I kind of like that these are like little artifacts that we find, not always just a little like tablet like thing. CMS, Ronak, all hands. I'd like to thank each and every crew member for taking part in this historic expedition. Never has there been a more worthy cause nor more dire circumstances than those we face today. While most of you aren't cleared to view the full details of this mission, know this, our hopes and dreams for our future are at stake. The fate, the fate of the colonies rests in your capable hands. Ma uh, Majori Graves. I wonder if that's Admiral. What I, what I was just wondering as I was reading that is if this was the character that we saw the soldier down on the planet at the very beginning. But that would have been 200 years ago. There's no way that this artifact would be here from that expedition, I don't think. Because this... I don't know if this is the ship that Ellie came here on, or if this was a ship she escaped to from whatever she rode over here on. I'm a little confused, kind of like we did. This isn't the ship we rode over here on. This is just the one we were able to hop on uh, after ours got all bombarded, <laughs> literally bombarded. So maybe she was in that same situation. So I guess it's possible that this is a ship that's been here for 200 years, and that is something that was actually uh, from the first expedition. I don't know. What was that? It was huge. It's terrifying. I see you guys. Oh my goodness, there's a bunch of you. Yeah, these little generator door things. They make so much a little rattling noise. Okay, you know what? I want to try out my other gun. Ooh. Give me that. And your other one. I don't know. Is this really doing me any good? I don't know. This thing feels like a toy. I might just dismantle that. It doesn't... Even when it fires, it's like... Puh, puh, puh. Puh, puh, puh. <laughs> nothing like... Nothing like when I fire this thing. Sounds like a shotgun, doesn't it? Some huge... Feels powerful. Yeah. I was curious to see, because I thought I had put some kind of like electric thing on there, but it didn't seem to do any type of like electrifying. At least not from what I could tell. Just one of those noisy doors. Are you dead? Oh, crap. Oh, give me that arm. Oh, speared him to the wall. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, gosh, that was impressive. Upgrade circuit. Plus one rate of fire. Oh, I like that. So that that's my first circuit I got there. It's exciting. Okay, let's check this text log. That was so fun. Notice to all officers, effective immediately, Admiral Majori Graves is confined to quarters until further notice. Post a guard around the clock to monitor her activities. Oh. Under no circumstances is anyone to talk to her. Fleet command now rests with me. Reroute all requests through planet side channels. Major General Spencer Mahad. Hmm. Man, now I wish I remembered the name of that character from the beginning. The the general or the admiral, whatever it was, we found down there on, on the the deck. So I don't know if, if the the female person was corrupt or if the secondary person was corrupt and just trying to take over. Oh, okay. Well, we got an elevator over here. Okay, it's locked. Okay. We're going this way. Ladder going down. Oh, they're coming out of the woodwork. 
fire! Fire! Oh no. Where the hell are you? Almost to the crossover tube. Take that keep coming! Sir, we're running low on ammo! Make a barricade! Just keep them out a little longer. Dang. <laughs> Guess uh they were probably like kinda wishing they didn't actually get cut out of that container now, probably. They are getting bombarded with a ton of them, it sounds like. Okay. Oh. Okay. More gel. This is crazy. Okay. Yep. Okay, we're in the ventilation chambers. Oop. Oh, what are you? Looks like one of those baby things, but it's like a dog instead. That's what it reminds me of. Where'd the go? Oh, you got me. Oh, I see one more. Oh, he's like got in the way. Woo. Come here. I don't know if we can get a good look at one of these or not. That was wild looking. Yeah, check it out. That is so weird. Uh, I can't swing my fist while I'm airborne, apparently. Okay. Where'd my goodie go? I heard it. There it is. Is Z still the way you kind of... Okay, yeah, it is. Good. That's just crazy. Uh, oh. Stacious recharge there. I like that. Oh, I'm probably going to need it on the way back. How much you want to bet those suckers are going to be spinning? If I had to guess. Thank you. Oh, I think this is a log of some sort. Yep. I was going to say, it didn't look quite like an item I could pick up. Okay, my apologies for the excessive noise, sir, but there's not much I can do short of sedating the entire canine unit. It was like a dog. The dogs began acting up the moment we went into orbit. Several have tried to claw their way out of their cages, ripping their paws apart in the process. I'd like to request sending them down to the planet sooner rather than later. It would be good for them to stretch their legs. Dogs are a lot like people and being cooped up for so long would make anyone stir crazy. <laughs> I don't think that's what's going on, but we are probably going to find more of those on the surface. I think that's what that was just hinting at. Gosh. Oh man, those things are ferocious looking. I think the baby versions were scarier though, if I'm honest. A little scream that they would make and everything. That's part of what made them just as scary as the actual look was their little baby cry I don't like the hum that these doors put out it's kind of annoying it's loud Norton you there yeah yeah I'm here all right I think that's holding them for now good the SOS is coming from directly above me and it looks like I found the ship's primary generator if I can get power going it should unlock the crossover for you. All right, what about you? Uh, there's an elevator here that goes straight up the spire. I'll meet you at Ellie's coordinates. Man, this looks old. That looks really old, don't it? Restore power. Okay, that's what he was just saying. Um, okay, yeah, this is what I was going to walk up to, but... One, two, three. 
It looks like... I bet I gotta move these things around, don't I? Or at least down. There's one. Maybe they'll turn the lights on in the place. Why are you just walking around in the dark the whole time? Maybe? Nice to get away from that noisy door. I see all these vents. It's only a matter of time before they all come busting out of there, isn't it? Hmm. I was gonna say, those look like med packs. Just lying on the ground. You know what? I'll use one. I like that. Oh, I did it again. All right, let's go flip that switch. Okay. I, I look at those sometimes. I think they look like they're green, but then when I double back at them, it's like, nope, they're not. Okay. Okay, it looks like number two maybe has to be in the middle. Is that why there's like that that light going across there? Let's go take another look at these. I didn't... It, the fact that they lit up green when I went to the bottom made me think it didn't really matter, but... That would also explain why they don't lock into place. Oh, wait, what's... What's this? Oh. oh! Oh crap, there's one behind me. Off with your leg! Oh, reloading. Oh, there's another. Oh! Oh, gosh. <laughs> Sorry, guys, if you've been yelling at the scream. Shoot the legs, shoot the legs. I need to be shooting the legs. Especially these guys, since they like to run. Okay, use another first aid pack. Okay, I think I see what's going on here now. So I put them down, but I gotta, I gotta fire them up. That is wild. Uh, that sounds bigger. Whatever that is. We're getting the attention of something bigger than these little guys, aren't we? No smoking. I'm a little nervous. I don't want to fire up this last one. Okay. Man, that's loud. Where's the other one? Oh, I know I heard him. Oh, is there another one? I thought I heard something talking. I was expecting something much bigger. It must still be to come. Activate! Dang! Hey! Hey, we have power! The crossover just opened up. You're welcome. Rosen, lock, you stay put. Isaac Carver will rendezvous with the Spire. Got it. Oh. My goodness. That was so loud. I don't think you're the one that... Did I already get what came out of that one? Where'd the first one go that I shot down? Oh, did it land up there somewhere? Okay, well I can at least get this one. Okay. Ooh, he gave me something a little different. I don't know, did I get anything out of you? 
Where's the one I shot down over here? Since I, there's such a variety of loot now, it's kind of a big deal when I lose something. Okay. Now, did I see a door on this side too, or is it just the elevator on that side? Run around this way first. Now, I did have somebody also tell me that this one actually has like side missions and stuff you can do too. Which is weird. I really didn't expect that. But I will do my best to try to take on as many of those as I can as well. Now, before we go up that elevator, wasn't there something out here that also needed power? Oh, no, that was further back. Okay. I thought about going and seeing if uh, if it was activated now. Taking a minute to get here. I hope it's safe. <laughs> a little nervous there for a second. I thought for sure we were going to be backtracking through that tunnel and those fans were going to be running. For sure I thought that was going to happen. Although I bet those fans are running now since the power's back on. Oh! Look at that. You found us. Oh, Ellie, baby. <laughs> it's Ellie. Oh, wait, what? You were too stubborn to die. <laughs> Captain. Dang, she moved on. Oh, uh, yeah. That's For sure. I say, Clark, great to meet you. Austin Buckle, Marker Ops. Uh, this here is Jennifer Santos, our little lady with the big brain. If it's true you can decipher the Marker script, this mission might still have a chance. Isaac, thank you for coming. Like I had a choice. I know, I'm sorry. But I have so much to tell you. All right, come on, we have to get, get out I of I thought here. they said her no, eyes didn't yet. match. Isaac, we need to stop the marker. The trail ends at the Admiral's quarters. She'd written marker scroll all over the walls. The answers are in there. I know it. We cannot leave until we know what it says. Yeah, well, then let Isaac handle the translating. We're leaving now. I got Buckle, you get Santos. Let's go. Oh. Go on, take care of your crew. They need you more than I do. Ooh, burn. Wow. Some of the bigs in the area for sure. Uh, okay. Hopefully we got a second here before it's gonna like come after us. Personal junior journal. Ellie's search brought us here. Wait a minute. Ellie's search brought her all the way out here to this derelict ship in the middle of nowhere. She claims the Admiral had discovered something about the markers and the necromorphs, but she can't decipher the Admiral's message. I doubt it, but I might be able to understand what the Admiral was trying to say. Okay, well, that's all well and good, but I thought... Um... Database... I thought there was a text log down there. I picked, oh, look at all those health kits. Okay, we're gonna use a small one here to fill that up. Okay, let's go ahead and tab to exit. Did I, did I not pick it up? Maybe that is what I picked up. Okay. Thank you and you. Wow, look at all that ammo. I'm scared to walk away too far because I'm worried that I'm going to trigger something. Let's see if we can play with our new toys. Rate of fire. Okay, man, I, I'm, um, this is a lot. I'm not quite sure what to do per se. All right, we're going to, we're going to do something with you. Um. I don't have a lower tool on this one, do I? No. Mm. Go to the circuit. Attach. 
Let's add that. So you can add damage, clips. Okay, so this is like different than... So before we would unlock the little nodes, you know, kind of, and there was a set path. It looks like now you can kind of play around with it how you want to here. Mm. Okay, it doesn't change anything on the bar down there, but we'll put it in there. I wonder if that's something that's more applicable to like automatic weapons. Maybe. Plasma core. Okay. Um, so there's not really much I can do there, it looks like. You unlock Circuit's Edge achievement. <laughs> nice. Okay. Oh, let's actually, let's select this. And can we take that piece off that I put on attach part these parts determine the basic projectile type okay it looks like once it's attached I can't take it back good to know I'm glad I figured that out now because that did not really seem to do a whole lot for me if you guys got tips for me on like good practices, things like that for the weapons, I am all for it. I don't think we found any blueprints. Mm, we can't do anything there because we only had the circuit. Looks like I could craft some more stuff if I wanted to. What do I need for a torque bar? Okay, I need some tungsten. So I can make one of those. Okay, back. Let's go ahead and move some more of this, I guess. Mm-hmm. And let's move you, but pull out a full clip. Man, that seems like a lot of med packs, but at the same time, I've been getting hit a lot more. It's, it's a me thing, for sure. Just practice, out of practice, I guess, but... Okay. Uh, all right, I guess we'll go with that. Does that by any chance save the game? It doesn't look like it did an automatic save. I'm a little nervous that <laughs> I might die and have to redo that. Okay. It says to go that way. All right, let's finish exploring this little room here. My. Oh, man, the place sure does look like a graveyard, doesn't it? Ooh, more ammo. Well, we definitely got some kind of a fight coming up. Plasma core. Ooh. Well, let's see what a plasma core does. I, I'm assuming it's a, a something we can attach. Uh, go with this. Does it show you? I don't see anywhere where it's like lighting up where the new item is. Plasma core. I can't put another plasma core on that. I guess that would be for a different weapon. Wait a minute, this says remove and dismantle. Hold on a second. Wish I could use my arrows for that. Let's select this. Clear. Removing this part will dismantle your weapon. Oh. I mean, I don't really like the weapon, but at the same time, uh, let's hit F for that. What's under craft new? Craft new upper tools for resource. Oh. Wow. Yeah, this. I, I'm finding this a a bit conf using and I'm scared to just do a thing you know what let's just do it let's just let's yes let's see what happens empty slot I assume I have okay I did get my my Tesla core back I got a military engine now 
<laughs> what have I removed and dismantled? I, I don't know if it even let me, but I have no weapons left. Okay, well, I got some, uh, some spots here now. Okay, well, before I mess anything else up, I didn't really like that weapon at all, so I'm not too heartbroken over the fact it's been dismantled. I'm sure it does drop me down to just one weapon, which might be a little risky, but what's that? What is that? Oh, my goodness. I'm still finding goodies in this area. Well, I might as well add that circuit to this. Anything else? I think I've checked the whole room now. Okay. Sorry about this. Third time going to the workbench. Increased damage? Oh, yeah. Definitely. Oh, that's why I didn't change anything. I put it on the lower tool. There we go. Rate of fire. Oh boy, that's a, a small buff, but I'll take it. I wonder how many people are already typing comments. <laughs> Dude, you put it in an empty spot that doesn't work. Okay, I'm starting to figure this out a little bit. I mean, at the risk of maybe doing something that I might regret, I'm just kind of going for it. Hopefully I don't make too many critical mistakes before um, I start getting tips and suggestions from y'all. Okay. Uh, so. Oh, I wonder if this is one of those things that require... I wonder if that's like a node door. Like if I had some tung uh, tungsten, tungsten, I forget what it was I needed. And had one of those I could maybe get in there. Okay. Onward. I, I'm sorry about that. There's so much going on. I so Norton, huh? I mean, that was quick. The world is ending and all you can think about is us? Damn right. I never gave up on you. Oh no. You get up on the world. Right? I paid my dues. Or don't you think I'm fucked up enough already? Isaac, this is do or die. We're stuck without your help. Are you with me? Doesn't look like I have a choice. Dude, you're doing a horrible job trying to win her back. Uh, why does it sound like it's right above me? Oh crap. What? Oh, fuck. Oh. Oh boy. Oh crap. It broke out the bridge. Where's another one? That rate of fire did not feel any faster than before, that's for sure. Uh Get this puppy going. I'll wound it, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I missed. Oh, dang. That did not last near long enough. I thought for sure I could at least get... Man, I wish this thing shot faster. Okay, it's all right. All right, do it again. Ooh. Come here, Spike. Oh, dang it. I was robbed. The spike fell into the back. I couldn't pick it up. And then when I finally did get it, it jumped at me. Jerk. That's what you get for interrupting me. There we go. Keep it coming from multiple angles here, aren't they? Zip! I feel like I hear another one. There he is. Ooh, right in the head.
Oh, my goodness. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. It's getting close. There it goes. Oh, I know there's something I didn't pick up. Where? Where's it coming from? Okay. I want to make sure it uses the, the smalls first. There we go. I think when I just push the Q button, it just uses them in order, so it's just defaulting to the uh, the medium since those are in front. I didn't want it to do that. Man. <laughs> this thing is serious. Oh, crap. Can I use this? Whew. Thought I heard another one. There you are. Oh, I shot it twice. Ooh. Gotcha. One thing this game still does a great job of, Dead Space in general, is they never release all the enemies at one time. They always send them out in like random spurts. Okay, so I'll need to put those back down again. Oh. My goodness. That was serious. Oh. Oh, crap. Ooh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, now it gives me the spike. That's why I was trying to get there for a minute. Where'd the ammo go? I keep feeling my ammo is falling off. There's one. Did my ammo go down there? It might have. Okay. Everything's better now, right? Whew. That's pretty good. I like that little encounter there. Felt like a boss fight, but wasn't like too crazy. Oh, I must have missed that on the first pass through. Jimmy conductors. What's this thing here? Why is it red? Hmm. Oh, look at that. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, well, I ain't gonna. I'm not gonna get blown towards it, am I? Oh, yep, I sure am. Oh! Oh, that was close. Oh, I'm still not used to how fast the. Um, Isaac Carver. All secure here. How the others still live. I'll meet you at the Admiral's quarters. Don't leave me waiting. The stasis seems like it wears off so fast. I am not used to that. Danger. Entering zero G. Nice of him to write that on a little sticky note there. Progress saving. Oh, crap. Oh, wrong button. Where do you, buddy, go? Oh, come back out here. Ooh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so many of them. Oh yeah. Thank you. I don't remember that being there before. Make sure you ain't something that's going to be an issue. I think, uh... Oh! Okay, well, let's go down this side first, then. That stomp! I love it! It's so loud! 
Hey, Isaac. Am I gonna stand here all day? Hang on, I'll be there soon. Hey, if you're embarrassed to ask for directions, just follow your waypoint. Dude, I'm scoping the place out. You can wait. So funny. Isaac's talking like such a jerk to Ellie. It's like, dude, you're not gonna win her back talking like that. Uh navigate. Um uh, what? Oh, I see. Oh, this is probably because I'm a solo player versus... Good thing I just played through the game Brothers. I got some good practice at this. Look at that. When did that open? Just over here, maybe? Oh, just the elevator, I guess. Okay. I guess where I'm going. Did they have to do that too? Or was that just for me? I don't know. Oh, that's right. I'm heading to the Admiral's. That was loud. Uh, oh dear. Oh yeah, I had to. That's pretty good though, wasn't it? Ooh. Oh. She's making markers out of stuff up there. Look at that. Carver, to reach the Admiral's quarters. Isaacs, turn it off. Hey, Isaac! Turn Isaac? it off. Isaac? Carver, what's going on? Turn it off. Isaac! Turn hey. it off. Hey! Turn it off. Hey! What is it? What's going on? Nothing, nothing. Everything's fine. Everything's turn it off. fine. <sighs> Ellie, the Admiral was obsessed with making a key. A key to what? Hey! Key to what? Some sort of alien device. A machine. I think that she believed that it controlled the markers. Oh my god. The codex thing she that we saw? To turn it off. She wrote that over and over again like a mantra. Or instructions. This is exactly what we've been looking for. This isn't just some random planet, Isaac. They found the source. The Marker Homeworld. You have got to be shitting me. Marker Homeworld. All right, let's regroup in the control room. We can plan our next move from there. Clark, shake it off. Let's go. Clark! <laughs> he straight up just left me. Regroup with the crew. I'm assuming that character that showed up right there is like... The, if I was running co-op, that's the character that they would be playing. That's what I'm guessing. My goodness. She doesn't look like she's in good shape, does she? Okay, what all can we find here first? Text log. Now, we haven't really found too many audio logs yet, have we? Turn it off. It says turn it off. In my head, it talks to me tells me things that no one else can hear. Just for me, just for me. Turn it off, turn it off, turn it off, and it will go away. It will all stop. Okay, well that definitely sounds like what Isaac was experiencing there for a second. We won't fight your war. Okay, we got a message here, it sounds like. Damn it, Marjorie. I'm risking a lot of brave men and women down in that ice cube. Soldiers that could be fighting the war back home. 
Now, can somebody tell me, for the love of God, what the hell we're looking for? We are looking for hope, General. Oh, good God in heaven. Support for the war and our ability to fight it are dwindling. We are out of resources, we are out of public approval, and we are out of time. Just answer my question. What are we looking for? Markers. You must be joking. No, General. I'm not. I will be sending Dr. Serrano to your quarters to give you a full briefing. You must be out of your goddamn mind. General, you are dismissed. I think that is the general that we were seeing there at the beginning. Looking for markers. Okay. EarthGov artifact. Personal journal. Ellie Langford. What's this doing here? I wasn't sure how he'd, he'd feel seeing me again. He's been through a lot, and I with him for much of it. Before I left, I could tell things were bothering him, but he did what he always does, suppressed it, kept it locked inside. I asked him when he was going to face his demons. He said some things should remain buried. Nothing good comes from digging up the past. It's strangely fitting that we find ourselves together once more in this 200-year-old flotilla doing just that. Unburying the past, I guess. That's interesting that that's in here, though. Oh, wait a minute. She did say she could. She made it in here. She just couldn't read it, didn't she? She said the trail stopped at the Admiral's office. Okay, so I guess she did make it inside of here. Uh, oh, I saw this light over here. thought there was something else to pick up. There for a minute when the light... When the screen started to get that yellowish hue to it, when he was saying, make it stop, make it stop, or whatever, I thought Nicole was going to come walking up behind him. I was like, no, she's back. You unlocked under a buck. Oh, look at that. <laughs> I just couldn't resist. I was like, that's so funny that's sitting there. I got to try. All right. Come, dear. Buckle here. We've tracked down a scrap transport shuttle called the Crozier. If we can get it spaceworthy again, we can use it to reach the planet's surface. No chance. We find the shuttle, then we're getting the hell out of here. Damn it, Robert. If we don't stop the markers, there won't be anything to go back to. Either way, it looks like the shuttles are only shot. Where is it? In the biggest ship of the fleet, the Terra Nova. But it's a long walk. Well, they must have had some way to travel between ships. If there's a way, we'll find it. I was gonna shoot that deer into some some creature, but as soon as I started the elevator, it just disappeared. All right, so they found the ship. Gotta find a way to get to it. There's something in here. Are you what I shot before? I don't fall for no trick. Necromorph's laying down where I've already been through. Just so they can jump scare me. Oh, look at there's something down here again. <laughs> this is like the ever giving hallway right here. I think that's the third time I've come down there and there was something to be gotten. Okay, can we go through this door now? Uh -huh, and I'm assuming that's the way. Yep, okay. Good afternoon, General. Admiral Graves asked me to prepare this information for you. <clears throat> When the Black Marker was exhumed on the Earth in 2214, it defied our understanding of science. It appeared to generate limitless energy, a trait of obvious importance in our resource-strapped times. There was an effort to replicate the Marker, hoping to understand its technology, thereby acquiring limitless energy for ourselves. Imagine our surprise when we learned they are not sources of energy, but receivers of it via carrier wave from somewhere deep in space. Triangulating this marker signal revealed a previously undetected planet, now known as Tau Volantis. We hope to find the source of this signal and finally harness the energy for ourselves. And if this works, it could mean a better future for all of us. General, thank you for your time. Good afternoon, General. Admiral Graves asked me to prepare this information okay. for you gonna repeat so but it's not that it generates power it receives it it defied our, our understanding of signal science. but basically that's what we see is the power this energy 
And so they found where the original signal was coming from. There was an effort to replicate the marker, hoping to understand and the technology. with the goal of uh, oh, why are you falling down in front of me? Oh, oh, <laughs> you jerk! That looked like something from Resident Evil. What's going on? Oh, gosh. Oh, that was terrible. Oh, rip it apart, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Stomp on it. Gosh, that was insane. I think there's going to be another one as soon as I open this door. Oh, it's dead. I think there's one behind me. Oh, I missed. Oh, I tried to pick the claw up. Man, that was nuts. How's the rest of the team just navigating through here without getting attacked like crazy, huh? Simon really, or not Simon, Isaac really does have like the worst luck possible, doesn't he? Well, one thing's for sure, I'm using stasis a whole lot more. These creatures are quick. And they like to jump at you. Okay. That spot where it was like, it sounded like something was building up on the other side of that door. <laughs> What's going on? And then you just had the speech going on. It was like complete chaos. Complete chaos. Okay. I don't think I went through this door earlier. Let's check it out. Mm. Oh, it's got goodies. I'm glad I found it now. Another circuit? Yeah, baby. Clip size. Oh, I do like that. Shotgun. Oh, that must be a blueprint. Wow, there's a lot in here. Yeah, I'll go for a shotgun. I'll take that over that little puny pistol thing I had for sure. Wow. Anything in you? I feel bad doing that to just normal people. Now, this is where we were kind of starting out. There should be a workbench out here soon, right? If we are where I think we are. There they are. Isaac, there you are. Where is everyone? Finding a way off this wreck. Santos, tell them what we found. Of course. We found a little maintenance craft, a skip. It doesn't go very far or very fast, but it will take you to the outcome of ships. Here, I'm sending you the coordinates. Now, let's get the shuttle so we can head home already. Robert, we are not going home. Hey, hey, <laughs> we'll get the shuttle first and decide what to do with it. I'm heading out to take a look at this skip. <laughs> Ellie, you're with the wrong guy. If you're, uh, recover the shuttle cruiser. Use the, wait a second. Uh, uh look at that. A suit kiosk? What's a suit kiosk do? Okay. Yeah, you're with the wrong guy if you're hoping for somebody who's going to stay here and explore this place with you. I mean, for Isaac, it's just... It's predetermined. It's going to happen, so... Uh, you want to switch back? <laughs> That's funny. One thing's sure, though. Isaac's got to start talking a lot nicer. Really does. Okay, only because they've been sometimes putting resources back in places you've already checked. I'm gonna check up this ladder again. Especially since we didn't find anything up here the first time. Uh, nope. I can kind of see to that other side. Is there? No, I don't see anything over there to grab. Okay. 
I do kind of like that we're encountering the people a bit and not just hearing them on the radio. I mean, if they're here, there's so many people. I'm actually a little confused on like who's who. I don't know all the names of all of his crew. Ellie, obviously, I know. Um, so, you know, it, it's kind of nice being able to see him in person. Okay, here we go. I have what I need to craft it. My goodness, there are a lot of blueprints. Man, that's going to use a lot of stuff there, isn't it? Um, yeah. I like the idea of having another weapon. Who knows, I might end up like... I assume if I disassemble this thing, I, I get like maybe some parts back. But, um... We'll see. Okay. Can I... Is this considered a two-handed weapon? Hmm. Let's go upper tool. Okay, that's what I'm on. It won't. Okay, here we go. I can put a lower one on this. Yo, check out the damage on that. Okay. Yep, let's add that. And... Okay, that doesn't do me any good. That's not going to do me any good. Can't do anything with that there. Okay, for circuits... We got clip and reload. Um... You know what? Let's just put both of these on here. Especially since I don't have um, any more space on my other weapon at the moment anyways. Okay. Nice. Got ourselves a little bit of a shotgun now. So something for up close. Something for ranged. I like this. Uh, weapon crafting, blueprints, weapon upgrades, crafting and consumables. Do I have enough? I don't. I need 20. I have 15. Okay. Oh, wrong button. I want to hit the safe real quick and, um, because typically I got a whole bunch of med packs. Oh, actually, I'm not too far off. And this though we're gonna move this and pull out a full pack of three i'm using that way more than i expected why is this in here oh that's that planet cracker thing okay i don't know if that changes anything or not so i'm just gonna leave that as is beautiful i like that Okay, well, I think that's a good spot to end this video. Wow. So we found Ellie way faster than I was expecting. I thought for sure... Boy, she's really working on that thing. I thought for sure this is going to be one of those things where we're, like, looking, like, over half this game trying to find her, and she sends us radio signals of, like, oh, I'm being chased, I'm being chased. But no, uh, we found her rather quickly. Uh, the rest of the team seems to be in some fairly bad shape that one character that kind of like shows up for that cutscene that we just had like i said i'm assuming he's who my co-op player would be that's why he kind of like randomly showed up and then just all of a sudden disappeared on us i, I got a feeling that's going to happen more so oh look at this some lockers i did not get to loot okay i like those Okay, but uh, yeah, we're going to end right here, and in the next episode, we'll be moving on to try to find this transport vehicle thing that they're talking about. That'll be in the next episode. Until next time, continue to be safe out there, buddy. I'll see you on the next one.